Juan José Seminario, Lucy Buccelli, Javier Alguero, Rodrigo Terán, Frank Vincega, and I, Manoli Bacchetti. This is more than a presentation. It's a training course in where we're going to teach you how to prepare a gourmet dish. Oh, sorry, do you want to participate? <laughs> oh, sure, come on. Well, we're going to start the class. I'm Chef Juan Jose. The plate that we're going to present is rainbow seafood rainbow. The ingredients are 50 grams of fish, three types of seafood, shrimp, octopus, and a squid. 50 grams, all of them. Also, we use for the decorative touch, 10 grams of vegetables in different colors. Uh, salt and pepper to taste. To make the sauce, we use one passion fruit and one tomato. Talking about the history of gastronomy reveals the close, the close relationship with the human evolution in the process of civilization. In this project, we have decided to focus more in our culture. Remember, to understand cooking, we should know the reason why to do it. That is, to feed ourselves. And that brings us back to the beginning of the humanity. In few words, the history of gastronomy is the history of the mind. Roman gastronomy changed over the time. It was influenced by Greek culture. But in that time, Marcus Gavius Apicio was a person that wanted to change the process of the food preparation because he wanted to present the luxury and elegancy of the dish. Also, he invented and publicated this book, The Art of Cooking, the Art of Cooking that is considered the Bible of the Renaissance food, and which contains 800 recipes. In medieval times, meat became the central part of meat, replaced by fish on day of fasting, when meat was prohibited by Meat and fish were roast and boiled. Also, it was common to cook them in tart or sweet and sour sauce with vinegar, fruit, or sugar, and seasoned with spices. As we talk about history, now we are going to start the preparation of our dish. First, we cook the fish. Yeah. Well. Now we have to talk about a little about a little the history of gastronomy in the ancient Europe. Our specialist, Chef Manoli, is going to talk about a little of the food in Asia and America. Asian gastronomy is one of the old. It's great value. It's a very healthy way of eating and very valuable. One typical dish is sushi. Now we we'll proceed to cut the seafood. The fish, squid, and octopus got it in the square, in two. And the shrimp, we're going to cut it by, by the middle. Like this. This will give our dish a required dish. One of the most important European gastronomies are Italian and French. France has one of the most important gastronomies in the world, for its urban. Have more than 400 types of pieces and the most, most expensive champagne in France. Italy offers many types of pizzas and pasta, cheeses like parmesan, risotto, and mozzarella. It's just a lunch of chocolate between so famous that na nowadays it's like. So the next, the next step for our drink is to get the, the vegetables. First, Juliana. 